Okay, so, of course, I touched something that I shouldn't have touched. And part one was the shortest thing in the world. So now we have part two, guys. I'm going to move the sequins away. I think it was just not a smart idea to put sequins on top of the pad where... <sighs> See ya. <laughs> Okay, and this is right. Oh, no, it's still tacky. Ooh, I'm excited about that. So let's just get this going. Welcome to part two, guys. This blickety blue is really pretty. It's like, I'm not like a royal blue. So this is what I meant by getting creative, having fun, doing your thing. So hopefully in the next one I can conjure up. Maybe I'll do the look first and get you guys motivated. And then start the contest. Simple sequins, right? And I, I have a lot of sequin stuff. So this gives me good ideas for, for, for up and coming. Looks, you know, next year looks or competition looks. So the reason there's a big blue is because I would love blickety blue to show off because I mean, it is a Hank and Henry product. And I started this Hank and Henry because I got the mystery boxes. So I might as well use some of the stuff from the mystery boxes, right? So here's my blickety blue. Ooh. So apparently if you grab more than one sequin with the tweezers, they start flying off. No lie. It's coming along, guys. It's coming along. Oh, well, now they're sewing and stuff. Oh, wow. They're sewing. I hear talk. You probably hear this all too. <laughs> it's all trust the process. Ah. Almost done. I wish I could do more, but it's just so difficult. The closer it gets to my hair, it's just so difficult. So I'm very happy with this right now. It's not even. That one goes high. This one goes low. Oh, let me fix that. I'm going to do two more. <sighs> There's no glue. No. Okay. Eyes is next. Gonna use this Anastasia Beverly Hills primer. And I'm gonna use this IBY. Blending, it says. It's a blending, but it's more like a shader. 
gonna take all this redness pigment away. I really like this. It's almost like a concealer, this primer. It's so pigmented. I know I've said it before, but yes, it's like that P. Louise. I really like this. Let's set it with some powder. I'm going to use my usual, my little color pop that I don't know the color of that's almost gone, panned city but i like it because i'm gonna use this hank and henry and savvy i like it because it just goes on so smooth and i don't feel it goes on like um cracked or cakey see it's like see like where you could see everything now it's like got smoother the shape of you see this line right here going down that's what I'm going trying to create now I think I should start how long does that go bring this down a little bit Clean it up. I'm gonna do is go in with here. I'm gonna do the nose part. So I did like a little triangle there. And then I'm going to go down and down. I'm not happy with that. Of course, I'm not happy with that. But I'm going to clean it up. Blue is hard to mess with. Now I got a better idea of where I want everything, so maybe I can do it now more neater. There we go. It's not perfectly lined, but it's okay. Now we're going to do the eye. So he has like a little wing going up, and then we're just going to go... This one's not, it's gonna take some time, guys. And it's not gonna be perfect. And I am shaky. But I'm gonna do my best. so happy i'm so happy and then i still have more concealer on the brush in case i need it now let's go back again and then i just go a little slower just to deepen the line We're going to work on the the nose that, that connects, not connects, but it gets close to the beak. So let me see.
Hmm. Which one? Let me see concealer. Oh, concealer. Concealer it is. Now the eyes. <laughs> so the eyes look like two almond eyes. So we're going to work on that. We are going to work on that. I'm going to use tape. I don't want, the black is going to be messy. I'm going to use this Smashbox Black Coal Pencil Eyeliner. And I'm going to make the shape of my eye. I'm going to try to follow it as much as I can. And then I'm gonna pick. It's not easy. I don't know if it's because of the base or because of the eyeliner I got it last Christmas. This is this been like a year. Does that mean it's too old, guys? If I could get one right, I think it will help me out with the other. I use the Metropolis. is an IBY crease. Let's see if you can see that. Crease from IBY. Yeah. It might help. And since it's a cream to powder, it's good. This is a nice, dense, round brush. I don't know. And, you know, well, I mean, it's cool as a crease brush. I guess it would be cool as a crease brush. And I'm just mixing it in. So I used the black eyeliner just to give it a shape. And since I knew I had this nice blue cream that would match up perfect. Ooh. Yes. I'm not sure if I want to do the bottom lash. Let's see how this looks. Ouch. I still got blue. Ah! 
there we go. My favorite secrets. I'm gonna do my lips with something Hank and Henry. Let's see. What should I do, Rich Lux? I love you so much. Love you so much. You know what? Let's go pink. I'm wearing pink sequins. Let's go pink. Like, that'd be crazy if I didn't, right? Even though I love Rich Lux. Mm, very prissy. This color is very prissy. Number one, you know, grand prize winner is, bam, Erica Mullins. Congratulations, Erica. She looks like a woodland owl, a Hank and Henry woodland owl. And look how she did her makeup, guys. That is beautiful. Her makeup matches her headpiece, which is full of feathers, like Oh, oh God. And number two is my beautiful daughter, Damaris. She looks like a snow owl. This was so cute. And this competition, congratulations to Damaris. That was second place winner. And grand prize winner, Erica Mullins. Yay! You ladies deserve it. You guys did wonderful. Thank you for um, joining this, you know, competition giveaway. There'll be many more. I love it. As I said before, and I will say again, um, I was inspired by Susan Young to do this. So thank you, Susan. Always in my heart and always in my mind, girl. I know you're doing your thing. She has a great job. She does a little bit of IG. She's still around. Love you, girls. Love everybody. Thanks for being here. Hope you like my Hank and Henry love. All good. <laughs> Bye!